What is load bearing structure? A load bearing structure is a structure in which the load coming from the roof of the building will be carried and transferred to the below structure using load bearing walls. The main structural element in load bearing structures are the load bearing walls and slabs. Load bearing structures make use of load bearing walls that are constructed with a larger thickness. As the thickness of the walls increases, we will expect a smaller carpet ratio of floor space for the particular building. Load bearing structural systems. The two types of loads acting or coming on load bearing structures are the gravity loads and lateral loads. Here, gravity loads includes the vertical loads that are due to the self weight of the structural elements and lateral loads include the wind loads and the rain loads. Here, under lateral loads, no earthquake forces are included as load bearing structure are not capable of resisting earthquake forces. When you look into the illustration shown, the wall act as the vertical load bearing member. The slab act as a horizontal load bearing member. The load transfer mechanism is the live load and dead load combination is taken up by the slab, which is transferred to the wall, then to the foundation and finally to the soil safely. Advantages of load bearing structures. It is a low cost option for the construction of low rise buildings. The design of load bearing structure is simple compared to any other structural systems. The external and the internal walls serve as structural elements. That is, it serves the purpose of protecting the building from weather like wind, rain, heat, fire, etc. Disadvantages of load bearing structures. The wall thickness of load bearing structures are high. As the wall thickness increases, the carpet area decreases. It is not possible to maintain uniform thickness throughout the height. Span length is limited in load bearing structure. When you design a load bearing structure, there are limitations for the height of the building that you choose. You can only provide openings in less numbers. The whole process is time consuming as the slab can be constructed only after the completion of walls. And finally, load bearing structure are not a choice as an earthquake resistant structure.